Do not try anything that you are about to see at home. Ever. Well, let's get started. Okay. Here at Fat Busters, we bust facts on the internet. Yeah, well, not just on the internet. So that we kind of make up just for your own entertainment. And also, Dave, there is rumors that, you know, fly around the earth. Yeah. Rumors fly? Um, maybe you should bust that. <laughs> Alright, uh, that'll be another episode. Well, let's see. I'm coming with a couple facts for today. Well, first, that a clumsy nerd can do an ninja roll, thus landing on his feet straight up. Hmm. I think I can be that clumsy nerd. Another one, that a Grantaman. A Grantaman. Yep. I'm the 2011 Savage, by the way. Will be suddenly attracted to an entertainment center when a light is si shined on it. Maybe. And we've got a few options for the third one. One, we can see if Walt Disney's cryogenically frozen head is real on the internet. And like, apparently he, like, froze himself or something. Also... To prevent cancer? Um, we will see if a nerd babbles on and on and on, while thus firing a gun. Yeah, while firing a gun. We'll see if they talk about random technical stuff that you have no idea what it is. Maybe mm -hmm. even using acronyms. Mm -hmm. And let's see, uh, we should come up with some pretty good third one. Yeah. Let's well, see. Hmm. Sign. Oh yeah, I, I, I remember it. That a laser will shine through an outside window onto the snow. Okay. Well, let's think. Well, what would be the most interesting for our viewers? I think the head one or the gun one would be the most interesting. Yeah. The uh, white shine out through the snow, everyone could do that, and I've done that 5,000 times and it works. Yeah. Well, Walt Disney's cryogenically frozen head, mm -hmm. it's hard to get some reliable sources. You can either use Wikipedia, or I once saw someone who edited it and said, try to say pig like, pigs like lard cakes, but he actually said pigs like eggs. Yeah. It's kind of weird. Yeah, so I say we do the uh, gun one. Okay. Well, Great, Jane. let's get on with the myths. Okay. Before we get any more okay. interferences. Oh, yeah. Well, our first fact is that a clumsy nerd, moi, will be able to do an injury roll, thus landing on his feet. Well, see how the first one goes. I don't know how to do a scale model of this, so we're just going to do it like this. Get ready. Get ready. All right. Probably start from back here and run. I'm scared. Looks like I can land on my knees. Wow. I think we need more explosives, though. Um. Psycho Fox, Grantman, we don't exactly have enough budget for explosives. Oh come on, Mythbusters has explosives. Yeah. Well, um. <laughs> That's with busters. Fireworks, maybe? Nope, not inside the house. Oh man. All right, well, I'll try that again. Yeah, Let's let's see. Take the second take. Ouch! <laughs> oh, so close. Oh, this, look, this myth is not looking, or fact is not looking good. Well, in that case, let's get on. No, wait, third time's a charm. Okay, are All you right. sure? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. For our second fact, we will see if a Grantman is attracted to an entertainment center. When the light is suddenly turned on, exhibit A, the Grantman. Exhibit B, the light switch. I don't think this is gonna work. C, the, the entertainment, entertainment center. center. He said it's not gonna work. I don't think really think so. It'll probably work. Ooh, Look behind you. An Xbox, a Wii, you got everything you need. Mmm, kisses, kisses. Oh my gosh, I love it. Love it so much. So, to recap, well, let's see how the facts went. Or the facts. I busted the first one. I cannot, and I'm a clumsy nerd, I cannot do an Israel lamp. And again, 
I think that wouldn't have been good as the first part because many nerds have feeble little arms and aren't strong enough to do that. <laughs> yeah, I know, I couldn't do that either. Of course, yeah, you're the one who was attracted to the uh, TV and stuff. No, that, that, that was acting. You attacked me. No. <laughs> Stay away from us, this dumb. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, the one about the gun, if you remember. Yeah, the, uh, you pull this thing back and the tension releases and then the bullet plane. Careful with that thing. <laughs> oh, no! What do you want from me? No! <laughs> well, another nice day's work. As you remember, our third fact was whether a nerd with a gun would start making random comments on how it works. Well, let's see. Gun! Hmm. Oh, so this is laser. It must shine through this thing, which bends the beam of it. Or something. Maybe it's a cover. Hmm. Oh, and this creates tension when it shoots, I guess. And oh, yes, the laser is a targeting system. And when it shoots, the this thing probably um, is, makes, is a lever or something. And sits down the fulcrum and suddenly, or not fulcrum, and releases the tension on this. Then this thing, probably most likely powered by a spring or rubber band or something, pushes air out and to get the dark goes. Let's see. Mm. Oh. I was right. Fascinated. Yep. I still think it needs more explosions though. I wonder what it does to a camera. Wait, no, no, please don't. Uh, you didn't hit the camera. <laughs>